We're racing now. Crank it up a gear, I'm, I'm coming in. Smashing. Working a treat there. Got a wee party of kids for me this morning. Here we are, we can. What a beast. That's a lorry done. Plants to sow some spring barley today. Um, just fill up feeders with animals, blah, blah, blah. and then get along to yard number three. Dad's kind of away today, so I need to be able to keep an eye on the cows when I'm in the tractor. So I'm glad I've got the camera anyway. Everything sorted out, and we're off. It's half eight, which is actually half seven because the clock's changed. Oh, brutal one that. Much nicer going the other way. It's Mother's Day today, the shop will be mobbed, so thankfully I'm along at yard number three in a tractor all day. Kev brought the forklift along this morning, we're at yard three today. He's got the drill filled up there, I'm on the discs in front of the drill, so we're all good to go. We're off, misty start, we're in a hollow to start, and um, just while it's dry we'll make sure and wipe this out, get it done, get it sewn, and get some structure in it. Discs are working fine, GPS is working fine, Smash. Smashing! Working a treat there. Oh, it's bumpy along this bit. There's an open fire to deal with. We're getting going. Done a few wins. Time for peace now though. Came early. We did have cattle and whatnot all to feed and sorry out this morning. You can see it's pretty rough here. Doesn't look that steep but it is fairly steep here so the discs are doing an okay job. You can see there's still kind of a bit of a rut through the middle there. Where that bit of open fur is there. The discs are kind of leaving a bit of a mark of it, but Kev's got a wee set of discs on the front of the drill and also obviously the power harrow, so by the time all that's done it's generally pretty flat. Work up this side of the hollow, then I'll go over and finish that side, and then we'll just go up onto the flats. It's pretty flat up the top there, it's nice. We've got the evaporation through there. Good Kev. Neighbours are out spreading fur. Getting on well, nice weather for it. Second half now. Done all the way up there. Kev's sewn right up to the top of the ridge there as well. Got a few stones already. Piling up. We need another one of them. That's what I was talking about the other day, stone grapes. Can't need my hat anymore, it's roasting. When we're doing the winter ploughing, when there's two ploughs going, we could do with two stone grapes. Because the wee plough, you just put a front weight on and there's no stone grape. And can't pick up the stones. Some of my stew kicking up there, you can see it all. Jesus. I can't complain that the stew kicking about anyway. I was getting in the cab, getting in the cab, shutting that window. I regret that. Uh oh, I think we've got a stray dog. I've no idea whose dog that is. I managed to kick on a bit and get quite a bit ahead of Kev, so I can now run off, go and check the cows, and then come back. Should be fine. Kev's just topping off with seat there, all going well. Put that in the shade so it cools down because it's roasting in the cab. All going well. 19, that's like peak summer. Didn't show you the cows there but everything's good. We top up on supplies, can't go wrong with a penguin. Penguins wouldn't make my top five but definitely in my top 10. What's the joke on it? Why are penguins shops so busy? Wow, that's a shocker. We're racing now. Crank it up a gear, I'm, I'm coming in. I'm coming in hot. Max Verstappen, round the outside of Charles Leclerc for the win. Verstappen on the inside, down the main straight. Charles Leclerc can't cover him off. Verstappen takes the lead at the Saudi Arabian Grand Prix. Well, I'll put this camera onto the discs, but it's going nice, conditions are absolutely perfect, couldn't be better. There's enough moisture there um, to allow the seed to germinate, and it's also dry enough to produce a really good seed bed, so smash. So there's two banks of discs, and they're probably offset 20 degrees each from uh, straight line parallel. First bank shifts the dirt that way, second bank shifts the dirt that way, sugars it all the way and levels it and loosens it off, and then a packer on the back just to roll it flat. We're on the steering wheel. 
Jeez, oh. You went flying. There's a buzzard. Big wingspan on them. The deer on the barley. There's seven of them in the middle there, you see them? Bandits. Kev sold ten of them last week. Who's got a rifle? Right, just went fish, Kev's empty on the seed so he's gone to fill up and he'll just park up. I'm just about at the end of this field in terms of the straights, there's the end rig still to do and whatnot, but I'm going to get to the end of the straights and that would be done. I've just spent five minutes getting some slow pictures because I think they're quite cool. If there's anyone interested in seeing longer images of the slow motion, which there already is on the plowing, then I could put them at an end of a video. They're very satisfying to watch. Probably got about 11 hectares sown today, uh, so it's not bad. We didn't really get started till 10, just shifting forklifts about and had all the stock to feed this morning and butts and bobs, so not bad. Sunday, so we just finished at kind of half five, six o'clock, so tomorrow maybe we'll go till seven, eight o'clock. A wee bit later, get a bit more done. Probably quite a short video today. Didn't really film a whole lot because I was just sitting on a tractor discing all day. So cheers for watching anyway. Like and subscribe. Will you dare to